So we're on the final day of Tech Barbecue. It's the last afternoon. All of us are pretty exhausted. I've done two talks today. And we've also had our little booth, our little smoothie booth. And smoothie is not a bad word. It's actually the name of our camper wagon, which is a brand here in Denmark. Anyways, I had a really interesting talk today about meaningfulness. And that was interesting because somebody asked me the question, how do you validate meaningfulness? Who decides if it's meaningful? And I thought that was a really good question. For me, who decides if it's meaningful is the user. The person who is actually on the other end of the device, using it, hopefully having a meaningful experience. They're the ones who have to evaluate the things. For me, it's about providing a framework for the companies to question their product and to try to find out, could this have something to do with me? This is what I'm really interested in. The creation of a non-glanceable device. You don't have to look at this, you feel it, right? This is one which enables tactile, passive, and surprise interaction. So I have to find some mechanics of meaningfulness, which I'm just going to run through quickly for you here. Something about personal development, right? All of us can always use a little bit of personal development in our lives. Something about who are we, what is our purpose, who is our future self. And then we have meaning in everyday life. So I can tell you, if you're in academia, never, ever, ever use the word meaningful. It's a terrible idea. Um, and basically, it's a terrible idea because our sense of meaning changes every single day and every single moment from minute to minute to minute, right? What is meaningful now might not be meaningful in a few minutes. So how do we design for that? It's a really tough question. General video. Yeah, yeah. So this is the portion of the conference where we hang out with statues. Barbecue has been exhausting and exhilarating, and Tech Festival is amazing. The future, future, I can't even speak anymore. Agency for Future Matters presented their 10 topics, which I'm going to talk about in a little bit, for technological and digital rights of the future. That was so important, and um, it's been good, so thank you.